Hi, it's Gina with your note of the week. This week's note is about the new user interface for CounterPoint version 853. The interface has a new look and a new feel and a new icon, but the functionality within CounterPoint has not changed. This is the new icon. I'll just double click. This is a new splash screen. This is one of seven different splash screens that you can choose from. This is the Sporting Goods splash screen. There is a new login screen. I'll click OK. And now to the main menu, which is completely changed from previous versions. Now the menu has side options instead of buttons to navigate to. So I can use the breadcrumbs to change the side option appearance so that they're just icons. I kind of like seeing the words though. But when I click on, for example, point of sale, I still have the same options I did in older versions. Something else that's changed is recently used. So your 18 recently used modules will show in the top half of the screen. And if I use this right facing arrow, there's my second set and my third set. I'll just go back home. There's also an ability to search for modules. This is pretty cool. So when I click on this magnifying glass, if I want to go to inventory, I'll just type inventory, and here are my choices. You may also clock in and clock out from the main screen. And here's something that's really new, favorites. So notice the bottom half of my screen is now blank. I haven't selected any favorites, but it's super easy. So I'm going to go to point of sale, and I want touch screen to be a favorite. So I'll just hover on the button, notice a star appears, I'll click on the star, and it fills out. So now this is added to my favorites. Next I'm going to choose customers. I want customers to be a favorite as well. And you know, I want some reports on my main menu. So I'll go to reports here, and I want to see a flash sale report, a management history report, and maybe a tax history report. So now when I return to the main menu, you can see my favorites down here you can have up to 12 favorites defined. Another nice feature is the fact that you can rearrange the favorites. So if I click on this star at the upper right, it's just a drag and drop interface. So I can grab tax history. I'm just going to left click. I'm going to slide my mouse and drag it to the first position. So now my tax history report is first. You can also access the internal email from the toolbar and change user preferences for the person that signed in. So that's your Note of the Week. Talk to you next week. Thanks for joining me for this session of Note of the Week. Hope to see you again soon. We would love to hear from you. If you would like to submit a question for Note of the Week, email training at ckSystem.com. And on the subject line, type Note of the Week. If you would like to schedule training time or request a free training catalog, Call me at 888-476-7911, extension 3. Talk to you next week. Bye.